hey guys what's up welcome back to another video so in this video i'm going to show you how you can download and install mysql server on your macbook m1 if you are using the jet cell as your default cell so to check which cell you are using as your default cell you can just open the terminal by just going to the spotlight search just type command and space to open the spotlight search and just type terminal and just type cat etc sales so you can see these are all the cells of i level and here you can see zsh which means you are using the z cell as your default terminal so if you are able to see the bash here so you are using the bash as your default terminal so i have already got one video for how you can set up mysql server on your macbook m1 if you are using the bash cell so you can just check out on the description so for zss i am going to show you how you can set up so for that just open your favorite browser and search for download mysql server and just go to this first link from dev.mysql.com and here you can see the operating system just select the mac os select os version so you can just check all and just click on download and here just download no thanks just start my download so you don't need to create the account for downloading the dmg file so once you click on that this will start downloading the dmg file for installing the mysql server so once this dmg file is downloaded so let me just click on show in finder and let me just double click to install so let me just double click on this package as well and just click on allow again click on allow and just click on continue just click on install and enter the password of your mac and you just need to use the strong password encryption just click on next so here you should just write the password which should contain eight character and mix up letter number and other character so let me just type accordingly and just click on finish so let me just enter the password of my mac and let me just click on close and let me just move the installer into the trash so let me just close everything from here so once this is done to check if mysql server is installed or not so let me just go into this system preferences from here and down here you will be able to see this icon of mysql so if i just click here you can see the instance has been successfully started so you can say that mysql server has been successfully installed so once you do that so let me just go to this terminal and just type ls hyphen a so here you will be able to see this dot z profile so if you are not able to see this dot z profile you can just type touch dot z profile and this will create this dot z profile so i have already got this z profile so i don't need to create it again so once you do that let me just type nano and just type dot z profile so here it has opened the empty file here so you just need to add the path of the win inside the mysql server so to find that just go to this finder and here you can see go option so just click on that and just click on go to folder and here you just need to type slash usr and just click enter so inside this local folder here so you can see the mysql and the version so just go inside here and here you can see the win folder so you just need to copy the path of this win folder so for that just right click and just press the option command of your keyboard so just press an option so once you press an option so you can see the copy bin as path name so you just need to copy that and once you copy that you just need to come into the terminal again and just type export and just type path in capital letter and equals to just type dollar and open the curly braces again type path in capital letter close the curly braces and just type colon and you just need to type the command and v2 paste this path of the bin folder so once you do that just type control and just type o to write and click enter and just type control x to exit and just type cat dot z profile and if it shows some path like this so the path has been successfully added into our z profile 
so once this is done so i just want to show you the demonstration how you can create the database so for that you just need to type mysql hyphen u root hyphen p so you just need to type the password which you have set while installing your mysql server so let me just type the same password here and this will open the mysql terminal so now to create the database i can just type something like create database and you can give some name like demo so you can see the query okay so now if i just check if database has been successfully created or not just type so databases so you can see the demo database has been successfully created now you can just use this database so you can perform all the operation and queries related to the mysql so this is how you install mysql server in your macbook m1 if you are using the z as your default cell thank you so much for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel